how is everybody doing okay that was a bad intro i know uh, but anyways i'm here with one more tutorial on this beautiful tool called art bmp converter have you guys ever wonder how to create custom paintings in arc and also how to create custom paintings in arc with a mod called ecos rp decor that has three different canvases medium large and extra large so this tutorial is exactly going to tell you how to do that. All right. Now to do that, first of all, you need some pictures. Hopefully they are not too high resolution and they are kind of squarish images. Even if they are not square, if they are kind of like rectangles, it's okay. Just go look for a quick photo edit tool you don't need to have a photoshop i'm gonna leave a couple of uh, online editors that you can do it where you can change or edit or crop a photo in one by one ratio so i have i have two uh, really good uh, images uh, can i make them yes i can make them so I have these two images and are you wondering who these pictures are? So Peach is Twitch online art streamer. Her Twitch link is Admiral Peach Gaming, which I'll be leaving in the description. Make sure to follow her. And this is really Boogalicious. She's also an art, she's survival game or variety streamer. Uh, she's also a wonderful person. Please make sure to follow her on Twitch. That's the end of the promotions. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to use Boogalisha because it looks really pretty. So once you have opened up this amazing tool, our BMP converter, whose download link I'm going to leave it in the description as well. Now open up this uh, picture in this tool. The left, one, left side is the preview of the image the original preview and on the right side is what it shows if you dyed that picture and now on the bottom right you have these multiple modes of painting uh, destinations as you can say so you can paint flags you can paint billboards you can paint dinos and painting canvases you can paint the small signs you can paint a human uh, or, or the character or a map you can also paint pumpkins i think i think that's why it's here but i'm guessing it's an atlas but i don't know if there are any pumpkins in arc and then you have the multi canvas like you can like set like 100 different canvases and then uh paint whatever you want on those multiple canvases but I haven't tested this multiple canvas or the pumpkin I have tested human small sign dino painting billboard and flag they all turn out to be really good given your image is contrast enough you don't want an image that has completely dark colors in there like it might be a good image in jpeg or png format but when you convert it into bmp it will not look good so once you have um uh, uh image uploaded just and you are trying to uh, paint a canvas just go to dino and painting canvas that should give you the one by one uh dimension or one issue one ratio of the uh, of the canvas because all the canvases are in arc are square now all of these you can leave them or you can mess around with it I don't I didn't I mean I did mess around with them they do not turn out really good unless you know what exactly you're trying to do the main important uh, setting you need in this is the dither so basically uh, difference means the number of pixels or the image how much pixelated it has to be the higher the number higher the pixelated lower the number smoother it will be so let's check it out so 
on the right as you can see as I am reducing the dither all the pixelation stuff is reducing kind of becoming smooth but at the same time the image is not super clear it's not exactly clear it has all of these parts kind of look like a retro look or budged look and if you increase the dither of course it will have kind of like a the pixelations but it has more texture more depth and as you increase it becomes more and more uh, similar to your uh, picture your portrait or whatever you're trying to convert it into a BMP so this is a general uh, rule or a standard if it's a real life just keep increasing the values until you are happy with it and for a cartoony style of the image just reduce the number so I'm gonna keep messing around a little bit while I'm talking so I think around uh, I think two looks good right now uh, right here uh, this one even though it's a little bit pixelated little bit distorted but I can I can see her uh, eyelining or eye shading uh, clearly uh, the shading on her neck on her face it's all a little bit more closer to the actual image so I'm gonna leave it at 2 maybe let's try a little bit higher nope I think either 2 or 2.1 looks good so I'm gonna leave it at 2 now this is the important part of saving so when you want to save this and so this is the first one if you want to save this one on the vanilla canvas the format of the file name should be basically whatever name you want to put with an underscore okay and sign as it is with a uppercase s and ig and smaller case and now here comes a tricky part if it's a wood billboard you have to type large underscore wood underscore C that's the extension for a wooden billboard and if you want it to save on a metal billboard you need to change the word to metal and if you want to change it to a flag and again uh, uh, this one will change completely again your name underscore flag underscore SM both in uppercases underscore C that will be your uh, extension for the flag and if you are painting a canvas it will be name underscore sign underscore painting canvas this is called uh, camel casing so camel casing is a programming term where you name your variables uh, like this like a starting letter with uppercase then rest of the letters in the word is smaller then you concatenate or join the next word with the uppercase and rest of the letters in lowercase so this is your naming convention for the vanilla canvas all right now for the ecos rp decor mods canvases this will be your naming convention your desired name rp so there are three medium large and extra large so for the medium the name would be your name underscore rp medium canvas underscore eco underscore c will be your name for a medium canvas and if it is a large canvas it's going to be rp large canvas underscore eco underscore c and yes you have guessed it right and for the excel it will be rp excel large x large canvas underscore eco underscore c 
I'm gonna leave all these formats in the description so if I have committed any mistakes uh, in the video description should be good so once you are good with your name just save them in this location go to where you have installed your steam I have installed mine on my SSD go to steam look for steam apps go to that folder and go to the common common is where all your games are installed go to arc go to shooter game go to saved once here if you do not have this my paintings folder just create a new folder and name it my paintings without spaces uppercase M and uppercase P and once you're there go in and just save it in whatever the image format you want I want it to be medium so I'm gonna save it as medium canvas and hit save and it is saved now to check let's go into the game I will be back once I'm in the game All right, guys, I'm back in the game. So, oh, yeah, um, I love uh, coloring my clothes in uh, Iron Man suit. Um, don't judge me, all right? But anyways, now back to the, uh, back to the mod. So let me increase this a little bit. There we go. All right, so where? so we have all different kind of mods but that's not we are concerned about right now we are concerned about the ecos rp decor mod all right looks like i did not place one down so let me make one real quick so this is where you create the uh canvases uh engram furniture and decor crafting table and we have s plus so i'm gonna start making one there right there now I'm gonna just keep it here I'll, I have to remove it soon or my tribe member will get mad there we go so now once you go in there what the, who's, what the hell Let me really uh, quickly reduce the voice volume so that even if they talk, I don't have to hear them. All right, back to this. So once you are in the table, you have to go to the canvas. Uh, frames and canvas. So here we have the medium large and excel canvases i'm gonna make a medium because remember i saved the file in as a medium there we go we have the medium what a wonderful guy he gave me a v1 egg it's a one fifth once uh it's a 60 v1 egg nice uh, let me stop this sorry we uh, this uh, video is taking a little bit longer than expected but it's it's for the good cause it's for the greater good all right I got this now usually the tool will tell you what all uh, things you need or let me show you this let me really quickly go to the community base where I actually want to put the painting in hopefully I'm not bringing anything there we go we are at the community base where I want to keep the painting see there you go that's one of the painting uh, that I made earlier for peach 
she is one of the owner of the server and a wonderful person you guys should definitely check her out and now I am gonna place this I mean it's not a great location because of the windows but I'm gonna make it again so I'm gonna keep it there and let's see if we can make a paintbrush here yep we can make we can indeed make a paintbrush here steal the community stuff to make the community stuff so equip your uh, paintbrush Oop, there we go and try to paint it so right now I do not have any colors now right here you will see load paints from this type so once you click on that since this is a medium uh, uh, canvas you will only see the medium stuff and this is the one that I'm trying to make here it will say what are all the colors you need you can either take a note of all these and make them one by one refer to your notes make one by one or you could just craft everything and bring them so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go back to my base real quick and I have a bunch already made so let me get to your safe spot so that I do not uh, pull other dinos with me last remote location alrighty we are here let's see I think I keep all my colors here yeah there we go all my colors are here so I'm gonna take all of those and the best way to make these colors since if you already have the uh, eco smart is go to the food tray go to structures and you have a dye mixer mix mixer damn that's a hard word and you make one of these which usually snaps to the uh, cooker of this mod and it takes five metal ingots as and go to the dye mixer and look at the crafting requirements it takes 15 azul berry you do not need water you do not need a stove you do not need like a actual cooker of course you need a cooker to snap it but apart from that you don't need anything you just pull for one make one you have 25 paint that's amazing so I'm gonna just take all of the paints that I already made and now I'm gonna go back to the community center let's paint Bugalicious beautiful face up there and equip hit it you have all these over here go to load paints from this type click on book see you don't have any missing resources because you have all of these colors and I'm pretty sure even though it says 204 percent it will consume only one paint but let's test it uh, which one was that uh, bug which is where is it it's white coloring let's check it out white I have 24 white coloring let's see after we are done how much it takes bug and once you select it shows just double click it or load painting I think double click doesn't work so click on load painting if you are wondering about what this is it's the Mercy's Beach portrait alright now on to book for the beautiful face load painting and it starts painting as you can see on the left it's consuming one paint and it keeps painting keeps using all the color we need silver sky tan see it only consumed one white coloring oh it consumed two white coloring alright so anything under 100% is one anything over 100% is still probably and voila there we go we have booger's face on the wall oh looks like that's a large womp womp well 
we made an effort right we made an effort that's all that matters now let's look at the white coloring how much did it consume oh it's consumed three of them because it was 201 percent which rounded it off to 300 so hold up book how much white 204 so there we go every hundred percent it consumes one painting and there folks you have wonderful custom canvases with custom paintings on them beautiful if you like if this was useful and you learned something new and you like the video and my accent make sure to hit the like button on the video and subscribe to my channel I'm trying to be more active and also click that bell button get notification whenever I upload a video and make sure to leave your suggestions feedback criticism in the comment section below and once again have a great day if you're watching it on a weekend have a great weekend be blessed stay safe peace